What's happening, everybody? Welcome back to this Fargo. And this is going to be a short little video, guys. We're just going to do a few pulls. We're going to go ahead and get a selector for either Nakarua or Haramaru. I haven't exactly decided which character I'm going to go with. Probably Haramaru because of the situation I'm in already. But before I go any further with any kind of pulls that we're going to do in this video, I do want to address something that a lot of you guys have been commenting on lately and in the Discord have been getting a lot of messages regarding this issue. So ever since we went to this update, the engine for the game has changed. And a lot of Android users have been having a lot of problems. In fact, I know for a fact that there are players that whenever they log into a game mode, like say, for example, they go into battle mode here, they go into league match, and they go ahead and hit battle here, they're immediately kicked out. They cannot go in here at all. And what does that mean? It means that they're losing a lot of rubies. The same thing with Absolute War and any other game mode in the game. They go into Immortal Dungeons, they get locked out. So they don't get their gold hammers. They don't get their resources. They lose everything. They literally, you know, jump in here. They hit set attack. They hit find opponent. They'll hit start. And then boom, they're kicked out. Every single time. In fact, you know, like I said, I know a few players that's going through this. And this is something that Nether Marble needs really addressed. And I did see some comments in the last video. And I think these are valid comments because in the last video, we talked about how the devs released that video talking about Demon Space and how they're going to rework it and everything. And that's all great and dandy. But the, the bigger issue is the fact that because we changed this engine, the a lot of these Android users are getting pretty screwed. Now, for me, guys, whoops, they mean to click that. Now, for me, guys, you know, I use an S22 Ultra. I have no problems on my phone whatsoever, logging in, playing anything, lag. I don't have any issues whatsoever, but not everybody has a $1,000 phone lying around. And maybe that is what makes a difference. It's a brand new phone. Maybe that's also what makes a difference, right? Maybe some of you guys are these older Androids. You're having some problems. But the valid points that a lot of people made in the last video is that, you know, hey, they're working on demo space, but what about all these other issues that we're having with the server you know we can't play our game we can't log in we're not able to collect our rubies all they can really do is collect their dailies and that's pretty much it i mean think about it guys just imagine if you were a player right and you came into this game and you were trying to go into dungeon here and you were trying to go into you know time attack right there's a lot of damn rubies in time attack every week right they're losing out on all these rubies can't log in right now but they're losing out on all these rubies. Just imagine if that was you, right? And what it's doing is it's causing a lot of players to have once a lot of negative feelings towards Netmarble, and I can't blame them for that. And it's also causing them to want to leave the game, which is something that we don't want. We don't put, want people to leave the game. We want people to stay and have fun and play the game. And But if you can't even log in and get into these game modes and collect your rubies, then, I mean, that sucks. That is absolute trash. So I really want to ask Netmarble, it's like, you need to really put your... A lot of your focus on trying to fix these problems right the least you can do is at least put in the forums like hey we realize that we have these login issues going on and we need to fix it we're trying to fix it we're trying to you know get it done that's what they need to do right you know instead of maybe trying to work on demo space don't get me wrong i'm happy that they're going to work on demo space it needs to be fixed really it just needs to be returned to what it was before i think everybody would be happy with that but if they made it a little bit more difficult and made it more feasible for players to get through and they had an EX memory error, that would be pretty awesome. But I digress back to the issue at hand. We need to get these issues fixed, guys. These players are getting screwed something fierce. And I'm asking you, Netmarble, man, work on this. Try to get this fixed. Try to help these players out. And I think there's even people still with the PC client that are still having issues. I personally am not having any issues at all. But maybe depending on the computer that you're using, maybe, you know, I mean, I haven't. A 12th generation i7 uh, CPU with a 3050 Ti GPU. Maybe maybe that's the difference. I don't really know. But mine's running really, really smooth. I'm having no, no, no problems at all. So I just wanted to point that out. And I just want Netmarble to be aware. Look, man, you need to fix these issues for these players because they're getting pretty damn screwed. Now at the issue at hand, guys, well, the other issue at hand, at least as far as, you know, me personally, is that I got an A1 Nakaruru. And I have a A1 Haramaru. However, with Haramaru, I actually already have one memory, which is sweet. And on top of that, I can actually go to the end and get a selector right here, right? I only need 40 more, right? So I got enough rubies. I can go to the end and get the selector, which means I can A3 Haramaru, which is probably what I'm going to do because that way I can at least get that third imprint stone. Right, and I believe I do have some pulls in here that I haven't queued up yet. I know I got some from the KOF Battle Pass. 
So let's see here. Let's scroll down. All right, so here's the EX Fire Summon Ticket. This is actually from the KOF Black Friday Pass. Uh, you know, where I'll be able to, you know, I'll get one of these characters, which is pretty cool. It's, honestly, guys, it's really not going to matter because I still won't use any of these characters because none of them are going to be A5. I have all of them at A3. So it just gets me one step closer. But yeah, not a big deal. It is nice to see the yellow there. All right, we'll just go ahead and skip it. And I got Lady Choi. I mean, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right, all right, I'll take it. I'll take it, all right? And then we have the BX AX Fighter Summon Token, right? Doesn't really matter, guys. Okay. Cue that up. And, yeah, I can't even use that damn thing because uh, the banner is gone. But no big deal. I'm not really too worried about it because, again, it, the chances of me getting any EX fighters out of that thing are pretty much slim to none. My luck has been pretty abysmal in that banner. And honestly, just like I said a second ago, it really doesn't matter because I wouldn't use those characters anyways. I know, right? It's kind of like whale problems. But let's go down here to the bottom. All right, I'm either like all or nothing, guys. If I can't get a character at A5, I just, I'm not going to say I don't care, but I just don't worry about them as much. Because, I mean, I know I'm not going to use them, right? I'm going to use my A5 that are the A7 characters instead. So let's see. Down here. And here we go. All right, so we got some, this is going to be for Haomaru right here, right? So I can take him to, oh, I actually... I can take him to A3 right now, right? So I could get a selector for Nakaruru. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I'm just going to do all these at once, right? Ah, we didn't get Jack. We got nothing at all. Now this here, I'm going to go down to five. See what happens here. I'm just going to skip it here for the five. Yeah, I didn't get nothing. No surprise there. All right. Maybe I'll get lucky. It'd be awesome, honestly, if I got Nakaru. But if I got some more Haramaros, that would be sick. I mean, I'd actually be tempted to try to A5 that character if I actually got, you know, got him in one of these pulls. I mean, we'll see. We'll see. Or even like, you know, when I'm going to that uh, selector in the banner, if I got him, that would be pretty sick. I mean... Like I said, I can already A3 the character. And if I get this, I'll get this pity selector. That would be a, that would be one step closer to A4, right? Okay. So let's see what happens, guys. Let's see what happens. I don't know. Hmm. But it does look like Nakaru is the stronger of the two. I mean, I really don't know. I mean, from the runs I've seen, she just looks like she's the old, like, Haramaru is OP as hell, but it, she just looks like she's more OP. From what I've seen anyways, right? Again, you know, depending on the account levels, the fame systems for certain colors, all these things come into play whenever you watch these runs on YouTube. You just never know sometimes. Okay, nothing. Which kind of sucks. So, I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, maybe I'll just use this selector for... Uh, Nakaruru, but I mean, Haramaru and Nakaruru will get a return banner. They will come back because they are in KOF 15, right? They're not collaboration, so I might just hang on to my selectors. I might just hang on to them and wait till it gets a return. I know some of you are thinking, what? Bro, you're going to wait? Yeah, yeah, guys. I'm a hoarding mofo, man. Yeah. I still got selectors from past volumes that I still haven't used. And booyah. So, I mean, right now I can either A3 Haramaru. Well, actually, I will A3 Haramaru just to make sure I get that third stone. And I can A2 Nakaruru or I can save a selector in the future. And I would have one for Haramaru already. And then I would just need three memories to actually A5 him in the future. Not going to do it this round, guys, because I'm not going to spend a bunch of money trying to A5 the character. Because the truth is, don't really need it. My favorite character, you know, Rugal's more than strong enough to do everything I need in the game easily. So guys, let me know how you're doing in the game. Let me know if you're one of those players that, you know, you can't log in, you can't collect your rubies from not being able to get into your game modes. And let me know how y'all guys' luck is doing as far as Haramaru and Nakaruru. And I do stream on Twitch at 9 p.m. GW7 time. The link is in the description below. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Y'all take care and have a good one. See everybody.